Hi there, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here. I just wanted to do a quick video demonstrating something uh, that I did today uh, that could be useful if you are subscribing to a cell phone provider in Israel and you suspect that you might be overpaying or even if you don't suspect, it's probably worth doing this at least once a year, if not every six months, just going into your provider's website. Now this is an Israel specific topic, so if you're not based in Israel, this information is going to be a whole lot less useful for you. Uh, but if you are based here, then uh, just consider doing the following. So here's what I did. Now, the only reason I actually did this in the first place was because I've been looking recently at a lot of uh, cell phone plans uh, because I just subscribed to backup internet data. So I was looking at all these data only plans from uh, Golan and We4G and all these, uh, Cellcom and all these different companies. And I noticed that the prices seemed a lot lower than what I was paying. It looked like the prices in the market had come down. So I thought, hmm, something looks a bit fishy here. So um, what I did was I just went and looked at Golan's uh, prices. And let me just get those up on my screen here at the moment. So this is what I'm currently paying, paying for a Golan service. I'm paying, uh, I'm on, I have two lines. One of them's at the 99 shackle plan. And one of, them, one of them's at the 29.9, basically 30 shackle plan. Now I've been with Golan since like, I made Aliyah like a really, really long time. And this 100 shackle plan used to be, you know, the one that everyone, every Ole was using because you'd get your uh, minutes to abroad. Um, and that was kind of at a time for before everything took place on WhatsApp. So it's become a lot less useful for me only really when I'm abroad and you can call Israel for free. Is it a good plan to have? Um, and I have a second cheaper plan just for my business phone. So um, you can see my last month in invoice came to like 177 shackles because I was abroad, I guess, for a bit of it. So it seems to me like I had the feeling I could potentially do a little bit better than that. So here's what I did. I went onto the Golan website and I checked out Hachavilot Shalanu, our current plans, and look at what they're currently marketing. You can see here there is a 500 shackle plan which uh, includes 5G connectivity and it's only 44 sorry 49 shackles you have to really read the fine print here it's 49 shackles per month and it's 44 if you get a second line on the plan um, and even the 200 gig plan is 35 i'm going for 120 gig so i can actually get more than i can double my data for slightly less money so it's worth updating both plans essentially um, and you can see if i wanted to go down to 150 the pricing is kind of illogical. It's also 30. It's basically the same price for virtually this plan and this plan. Now, uh, what you can do, what you can do is as follows. You don't need to threaten to leave Golan. You don't need to, if you notice a discrepancy like this. And the reason I say it's worth checking because nobody from Golan, to the best of my knowledge, and I say that because sometimes my phone is unreachable. To the best of my knowledge, nobody from Golan has called me to say, hey, you know, it looks like you're paying 50 shackles a month too much for your 500 gig plan, for your main plan. You know, we're now offering that same plan for half the price. So uh, I don't think phone companies are going to do that really, or you can't expect them to. So therefore, uh, take matters into your own hands. Now, you don't need to threaten to leave. You don't need to yell at anybody to get this done. You just need to go onto the website and you can see here, uh, there is a button called Peolot Nefutsot and uh, additional options and you can basically just switch plan um, through the Golan website and move to the cheaper plan. So I'm about to go on to the uh, 500 gig plan um, on my main phone and I might put my, uh, my other phone onto a uh, similar plan or a tiny bit more but with double the data. So I think it's worth uh, keeping an eye on this. The other thing that you can check with Golan and all these phone companies is it's really, really worth digging into the fine print, unfortunately. So I just clicked into the, um, the data here for the, the PDF, setting out the terms and conditions for that updated 500 gig plan, just to make sure there, there, weren't, any, there, there weren't any catches and that I would be eligible for it. Um, and you can have a look through that, uh, that documentation there. So if you are uh, getting a cell phone, if you're with the same company for a number of years, there is a good chance that you are grandfathered at an old plan and you're paying too much for that plan. And you're not gonna know it unless you go and you are proactive and you check yourself, compare the current plans they're offering 
with what you're paying and if you notice a discrepancy either change or call up the phone company and tell them hey what's going on here I can see you're offering this for 50 I'm paying 100 this isn't cool I have other options I might leave and I don't like making that threat you know um, capriciously but if you really are thinking about moving to a different provider because they're offering a better deal for the same connectivity by all means tell them that so uh, this would just be my quick tip uh, if you're looking to save money on your cell phone service in Israel this isn't a you know it's 50 shackles multiply that by 12 it's uh, you know it's gonna be 600 shackles a year just for five minutes of your time checking out the latest plans hope this video is useful and if you'd like to get more videos from me please feel free to subscribe to this YouTube channel